Hey, welcome back to the shop. Today we are going to we're going to roast some coffee. Some this is some Guatemalan uh, wet processed green coffee beans, and they eh, they kind of smell like freshly cut grass uh, right at the moment. So we're going to use our Jenny Cafe uh, coffee roaster. So, disclaimer, this is not a how-to roast coffee. This is not a anything about uh, the coffee beans, the roaster. This is just simply to show you that roasting coffee can be done. And that's about it. So, let's, uh, let's get busy. So... So, the way this, this thing works is we have a chambered, a chambered, um, whatever this thing is, a little tumbler. And the hot air goes in through here. This thing is a wiper, which wipes the chaff off of the outlet port. And it basically just pushes 450 degree air through here, keeps the beans moving and uh, roast the beans. So here's our max dry process and these are of course wet. So this is going to be 10 ounces of beans and there we go and so this these beans are being custom roasted for Brulette's Wine and Beer Company, which is in Clinton, Indiana. They are going to make a prototype coffee stout, and we are going to roast some beans for them. So, here we go. Drop that down for safety and stuff.
All right. So uh, the last little bit was our cooling process. So the beans are roasted. The beans are cooled. And um, so now we're going to pull this out of here, but be careful. Uh, this is going to be hot. So remember, safety third. And wow, that is toasty. Yowza. Ha. And then without burning ourselves even more than we already have. Let's open this up because we want to get them out of here as quickly as we can. And that's toasty. Go figure. Whew. So, hot pads may be a good idea next time. There we go. Boom. So that is a nice dark roast for our friends at Brulette Wine and Beer Company in Clinton, Indiana. And this is for their, um, that's for their, their stout, coffee stout that they're going to brew and see about putting that into production. So. Thanks for watching. Remember, this isn't a tutorial video. This is all about Sharon because Sharon is Karen. All right. We'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.